Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. Simplify shipping sorcery. Explore the enchanting world of printing shipping labels directly from your Squarespace Realm, a seamless process, a perfect touch for your e-commerce ventures. So guys, without no further talking, let's get started. So before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So basically guys, in this specific video, we are going to follow this article which is right in front of us. So the first thing is, this is an article which is made by Squarespace Help Center. And they are here explaining on how we can actually use the feature of buying or printing a shipping label. Well, the shipping label is basically that ticket that will be printed on the box of your delivery that can explain how much it costs, what it has, uh, the delivery address, and some other information as well. And these are very, very important to make it easier for delivery service. So here we are going to read this article and understand well how we can actually get to use it. Well, the first thing is, as you can see, we need to get UPS or USPS shipping labels directly through our store for order shipping within the United States. So this is only for the United States. So if you ship products within the United States, you can buy and print UPS and USPS shipping labels through Squarespace to streamline your order fulfillment processes. For help with printer, hardware or software issues, contact your device manufacturer for help with lost packages, contact UPS or USPS. So here are the requirements. The first thing is you can buy shipping labels through Squarespace if the billing address for your website subscription is within the United States and your billing currency is USD. So, when someone is actually uh, buying from us and it has a subscription from United States and our currency is from basically, um, like, is basically USD, well, in that case, we can simply uh, have it, the full requirement fulfilled. So here, let's go and check if our currency is uh, USD. So tutorial, let me just name this website tutorial. Here we go. Here, I'm just going to simply uh, add something like that and then next 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 finish and after that I will simply just wait for it until it will created click on exit and my website should be created in a couple of seconds this is the best thing about Squarespace is you don't have to actually do a lot of effort simply your website will be created within a couple of seconds so here if you want to the settings you will find everything from the billing etc etc so here you can find your business information and you will find everything about the card etc etc so the first thing is your business information in the first place has to be within the usa so this is the first thing your billing information or your business information should be within the usa the store payments also has to be accepting the store currency which is usd as you can see settings store currency is usd and it should access most of the us uh, most used uh, payments getaways for example there is stripe there is paypal there is square so you can use whatever you want from these and now after you saw that we have the first one actually fulfilled you ship products in the united states so you have to be shipping products only in the united states you are on a business, commerce, professional, or premium plan. So if I want here to the settings, and as you can see, if I try to click and update my website or to publish my website, they will ask me to actually uh, upgrade it. So for me, if I clicked on upgrade, that means I'm not really on any of these plans. What you should do is to actually get one of them. Well, as you see, there is four different ones. There's the personal, business, commerce, and commerce advanced. So, whatever one fits you the best, you can go for it. Well, the most important thing is you have to be on one of them. This is the most important thing. Um, and basically, after you fulfill that, you have to be using computer or the Squarespace iOS app. It's not possible to buy shipping labels through the Squarespace Android app. So this is the most important thing. And you ship product via UPS or USPS. It's not possible to buy and print shipping labels for other services at this time. So here, 
there is basically here are the carrier services you can offer through this integration and created your first label simply just click here as you can see and basically it just comes up to the same thing so when creating your first UPS shipping label you will create a new UPS account or into an existing UPS account so note if you use existing UPS account you will purchase your UPS shipping label through a supported fulfillment course based extension not through our shipping label panel so this is how you're gonna do that you have to go through here and log in and do something now for them here they are what they are asking you to do to open the order panel so here I'm just going to open the order panel of this website let me just close it or I'm going to go back here here we go all right they're not even letting me cancel it well it's all right I'm going to open this website which have been just created right now go to the order panel so here we are this is the order panel and normally here you will find every single order so normally when you, when you receive an order you'll be able to see all the orders here click a pending order so it has to be like a pending order which is going to be right here and when you find the orders click get UPS rates this opens a window where you can create a new UPS account or log into an existing UPS account so this is basically it after you create a new UPS account, you have to click on continue. Log into an existing UPS account or do whatever you want. So there is two options. Either you create a new one or log into an already existing one. To use an existing UPS account, after clicking get UPS rate, click I already have a UPS account. This will open a pop-up window asking you to connect a fulfillment extension. Click connect extension to open the extension panel choose one of the following fulfillment services there is Shippo, ShipStation and EasyShip you can choose whatever you want from them so these are the main uh, basically the main labels or the main services that will help you to ship it very easily through UPS or USPS so you can use whatever you want from these depending on price for example this one will, you, you will just pay per label this one you will pay per month this one you will pay also per month but it is free as you can see starting at zero dollar per month so depend what you really looking for you can get it from here and after that you can simply head up and start creating your first shipping label so you can open the orders panel click open the order click purchase label click edit to edit the customer's shipping address this change will appear uh, on the shipping label but not the order summary uh, click the type drop down menu to select custom packaging or select UPS or USPS for carrier packaging if you are shipping uh, hazardous materials then check the shipment contains hazardous materials box the shipping services if you select custom packaging well you have to fulfill this informations and so go on so the the adding the shipping label is pretty complicated but as long as you are in US and using UPS and USPS you'll be all good. So yeah guys that was it for today's video if you did enjoy it make sure to leave a like and thank you guys a lot for watching.